that. Yes, that That's is correct. right. Yeah, I know. And summery temperatures finally returning. I know earlier this week it was below normal. Here's a live look out at the National Harbor. That bird basking in that sunshine out there this morning. Seeing those clear blue skies at the National Harbor, but we're not seeing that everywhere. We are seeing some areas of reduced visibility. Finally, Hagerstown, we're now up to two miles of visibility now after being uh, below a mile of visibility for much of the morning. It's all because of patchy, dense fog. And we're seeing still some of that fog lingering around Frederick, where we're down to five miles of visibility. So certainly seeing some improvement across the area. But temperatures now into the upper 50s to low 60s for, say, Winchester, as well as Martinsburg, Woodstock as well. Low 60s for Manassas, but up towards Leesburg, we're upper 60s. We're nearing 70 in D.C. Finally, low 60s. 60s in Frederick in, uh, after being into the upper 50s for much of the morning. We're 67 down towards Fredericksburg. We're all clear across the area right now on radar. Count that chance for a spot shower or storm, mainly for the southernmost parts of our viewing area later on this afternoon. But we'll see high temperatures today, varying low to mid 80s. Mid to upper 80s is really right around the seasonable high temperatures for this time of the year. And we'll be right around that for DC with a high of 86. 85 in Waldorf, 85 in Lexington Park, 85 also for Fredericksburg. Future cast though, timing it out. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds developing this afternoon and then a chance for a few of those spot showers or storms, mainly for the southernmost parts of our area. We're talking down towards Culpeper County as well as Spotsylvania County later on this afternoon, thinking between 2 and 6 p.m. By about sunset, we should see dry conditions all across the region and we'll see mainly clear skies developing overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning, which is really great time if you're trying to see the northern lights. It is possible we could see that across our area right along the horizon. I mean, it's, it's cutting right across parts of our area, uh, at least into early tomorrow morning. So if you do see a little bit of that color along the horizon, that's possibly uh, the northern lights into early tomorrow morning. Now, overnight lows tonight will be falling back into the upper 50s to low to mid 60s across the region. Tomorrow, a little bit hotter than the day today. Also, noticeably a little bit more muggy as well. Certainly feeling much more summer-like out there. Mid to upper 80s. We're talking 88 in D.C., 85 Winchester and Culpeper, 87 in Fredericksburg for tomorrow's high temperatures. And speaking of tomorrow, also came with that chance for maybe a spot afternoon thunderstorm. And again, very spotty. Not everyone will be seeing those. And as we look ahead towards Saturday and Sunday, keeping an eye on this low down towards our south that continues to inch its way closer towards our area. That will be throwing us some showers mainly along and south. South of DC as we get towards Saturday morning, and then we could even see a few rain showers into Sunday as well. Here's a view of that eight day forecast mid to upper 80s to round out the work week. That's much more closer to normal. Some scattered showers and storms for the weekend, but not a washout by any means, and much more rain showers on the way as we look ahead towards the start of that work week. So unsettled as we look ahead towards Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Right now, toss it over to Shiniko at the very latest on traffic. How's it looking now? Hey, good morning, Jackie.